Hello and welcome. Thanks for joining me for your in-depth weekly horoscope for week commencing the 24th of February. Please stick with me to the end because there's such a lot, an exciting amount of activity going on this week. Not least, we have the energy cascading into this situation from last week's new moon in the sign of Pisces, which is all about instinct. And this is linking up to Mars, the planet of passion, which is exalted in Capricorn. And also uh, the Sun and Mercury, despite Mercury's retrograde, are very close together. And Mercury too is forging a terrific angle to Mars. So we can think on our feet. Of course, precision with Mercury retrograde continues to be important. If we rush something or we're careless, we don't really attend to the details, something could go awry. But also, Jupiter and Neptune continue their loving. They're the two rulers of Pisces. So if we do want to ascend to a higher part of ourselves and of, of being, the opportunity is there. And Mercury is also forging a fabulous angle to the North Node in Cancer for the first half of this week. So if you have an instinct about where a trend is heading, then do trust your judgment. So what might be more challenging? Well, to be honest, in the first half of this week, it's about Venus and Jupiter. And in the second half of this week, it's about Venus and Pluto. Someone or something can seem larger than life and we could be absolutely wrapped with enthusiasm and admiration. But don't pitch in too quickly, whether it's around loot or love, before you know if there is a catch, because I think it's possible there will be. So stay with me to understand how this will pan out for your specific zodiac sign. Your specific forecast, Gemini, suggests that the energy of that new moon is making you think very carefully about your role in life and whether you're getting the rewards and recognition or respect for what you do, whether it's at home, if you're a hardworking parent, or it is around your career and ambitions. What I would say is, although Mercury, your ruler, is twisting backwards still and can join in with the sun, the angle they both had to Mars can give you a sense of urgency. And this can see you punching through obstacles, or at least being very much desirous of doing better, improving your lot, particularly financially. But what's going on around your relationships, whether it's around friendships or a romantic tie, if there's any sense of control or possessiveness or limitation, or you feel someone's trying to steer your moves, even if it's uh, hidden under a veneer of charm or attractiveness, then just be conscious of what their motives may be. Someone also in your friendship circle can seem enormously alluring, perhaps even at a sexual level. But just consider what you want, because Pluto is about raw desire and power, and it's linked to Venus, which is also about affection and attraction, can be a very evocative one. So if something pans out in the second half of this week, be sure you're clear about what the ups and downsides are. It's been a real pleasure being with you. If you'd like to ascend above your zodiac sign and embrace personal astrology and understand what makes you tick beyond just where your sun's located, please see the link beneath this video where you can order your personal character analysis and also uh, your 12 month forecast and also achieve a 30% discount, or you can choose to have a one-to-one -one personal consultation with me. But for now, good luck and goodbye.